this is the history of my cerebral palsy condition. I was as close to born with it as you can get. It happened during birth due to oxygen deprivation. The cause of the oxygen deprivation has never been found. So I've always had my condition and I don't know why it happened. It has affected me in the way that I had to do a lot of physical training from childhood. Uh, almost daily training until I was six years old and from then on two times a week until I was 10 then it became almost daily again and it's currently daily training to get improvement and it has affected uh, me in the way that I had to go to not a special school but I had to be very selective of where I went to school I have had difficulty socializing in high school because I need a caretaker and I need assistance with several daily things such as cooking food, washing clothes, stuff like that. My family decided to come from for stem cell therapy because my mother met a girl and she had been diagnosed earlier with autism but after the treatment her diagnosis was lifted and then my mother started to search on the web uh, for different stem cell therapies and found the one with least side effects uh, or no side effects at all I believe and the most effective one and then we decided to go and come here to San Diego. I came to Tijuana and had my first treatment and I was uh, very nervous because in Denmark we have the public health service system and it is very disrecommended to take treatment outside of the system and it was my first time ever doing so, but the treatment turned out great. I had positive effects after just a few minutes and I was very happy. The positive effects that I noticed the quickest were increased dexterity and movement in my fingers, on my right hand and in the wrist. Uh, then later came increased movement in the knee and in the ankles. and. Uh, then over several treatments it became more uh, yeah, the ability to stretch the legs, to carry more weight, to stand up more straight and to simply just have better mobility overall. My responsible physical therapist at the first treatment uh, made a few tests before I went and then repeated the same tests after and he saw great improvements. I don't remember the exact numbers but he put one of the tests walking tests from five minutes to under one minute uh, so he saw great improvements